up guys welcome back to my channel or if you're new here welcome to my channel my name is Nicole and I'm going to be reviewing milk and honey wigs today as you can tell or if you couldn't tell you probably can I'm wearing one right now and I love it I think it looks amazing I haven't really done anything besides cutting the lace that it came with so um yeah this is the hairline as you guys can see it needs a little bit of plucking i haven't done anything yet but this is what the wig looks like this is one of the two wigs that i got if you want to see the back you can probably see my my hair behind there but this is what it looks like um it's quite long it comes down to here and it's like a nice blondish caramel color and it's so pretty okay so this wig is called the Florence Lace Front Wig and it was $260 um, but I got everything discounted because there was a sale going on at the time. So that is why I purchased two wigs. So this one is the Florence Wig and it was $260. This one that I've got here is called the Montana Caramel Fringe Wig. Um, it's currently in one of these bags if you can tell well uh, you can't really tell but it's currently in one of those bags with like the little holes in it i'll show you guys this wig later but that one is called the montana caramel fringe wig and that one was 189 dollars so they first of all come in a bag like this it's a nice silky satin bag which has the brand name on it and then when you open the bag, it comes with a wig cap. Both of them came with a wig cap. And then it also came with a little wig care pamphlet or a wig care card. And then it also just came with their milk and honey card. So... Yeah, that's what comes in the bag. I think it's such cute packaging and it feels really like fancy because there's even like little gold clasps on um, on the bag. So it's really cute. But yeah, that's how they come packaged. I think they are such good quality. Like these are probably the best wigs that I've ever actually purchased before. And my mom also has one and she loves it. And I think it looks really good on her yeah i don't know i think they just look amazing um if you obviously fix the hairline and like maybe do it a little bit better than what i've done i think it could look amazing on anyone let me show you guys this one so i can show you the inside of what the wig has so this one wasn't actually a lace front because there is a fringe on it so this is the inside of what the wig looks like this one also looks like that on the inside but it had lace at the front so i trimmed it but yeah this is what it looks like it comes with three clips on the inside so two on the sides one on the bottom and then it also comes with these little strap things that kind of look like those things on bras it comes with that please ignore my nails and that you just clasp like at the bottom down here and it feels very secure. I haven't even put the clips into my hair. I've literally just placed this on and clipped that bottom one. And it feels so tight. Like I couldn't move around and this doesn't feel like it's going to come off. So I love that because every other wig feels so big on my head. This one is super long. Like it's longer than the one I've got on now I think. And this is what it looks like. Very long. The only thing that I don't like about this wig is the way that it's coloured. I think it could have been like blended in a little bit more. But yeah, this is how it looks. It's super cute. I also had to cut the fringe because it was literally like I could not see. So I had to cut the fringe. Don't know if I did a good job. But this is what this one looks like. I can insert photos of what it looks like on so that you guys can see. Um, but yeah, it's a cute wig. Um, the color, the brown color is probably my favorite. Like, I would love to get this color on my head. But again, I don't want to damage my hair. So this is the next best option. Again, I think it's so cute. The quality seems amazing. It does feel a bit thin, like up here near the scalp area. But other than that, it feels like really good quality. Um, it does get tangled a little bit, but I think every wig gets tangled. And yeah, it's 
a synthetic wig also it's not real hair obviously they've got so many different styles on the website I haven't been told to make this video I am just making it myself because I have a few wig videos on my channel and yeah so this is definitely the best wig that I've purchased or the best two wigs that I've purchased and I'm happy with them especially for the price like you want to be happy with them and I think they do a great quality I think the colors also look pretty freaking amazing and I definitely would recommend these wigs I would go out in these wigs and for me to say that means that I think it actually looks really good and it looks pretty natural and real and yeah so as you can see here this is where the lace is and you can obviously lay that down so if you're going to be like tying this back or anything i would say to lay that down i couldn't have asked for anything better like what look at the style of this thing oh my god it's so pretty what get yourself a wig because who doesn't love wig 10 out of 10 it looks amazing i'm just really scared to like brush it because i don't want the curls to go or the waves but you can style this wig, you can straighten it, you can curl it. You have human hair wigs and full lace wigs on the website. I just cannot afford that. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Hit the like and subscribe button down below if you want to see me some more. Not that you need to, but if you want to, hit it down below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!